Hey guys, welcome back to a new video. Today we're going to be doing a full body workout. It's gonna be a little longer. We're going to do a lot of like stretching in between and really working all those inner muscles. So come hip wide apart, start rolling the shoulders backwards, loosening up the body. And take a deep inhale. Exhale through the mouth. And rolling shoulders forward. Really loosening it up. Maybe circle your right arm forward. Big circle, you wanna reach over and backwards, reverse. I know I feel tight shoulders from working behind the desk a lot. <laughs> okay, other side, reach forward, big circular motion. There we go. And go back. Now, need to move a little forward. <laughs> Taking both hands and bending the knees, loosening up the body, letting your arms fall down. Yeah. And reverse. Keep breathing. And hold up here. Now, reach. Close your hands together, reach up to the ceiling and open up your chest forward and look to the ceiling. If you feel your lower back here, come back a little bit. It's more important to stretch up than far back. Open up the shoulders into a cactus position, bend the 90 degree angle and reach them back up five times. Five. Really feeling the shoulder break. Stretch up here, the neck. Three, two, and one more. There we go, come to the front. Bring your right leg up and stretch your quads here. Really pull the abdominals, keep your balance here. Start prepping. And keep breathing. Other side, I want you to really focus on your breath throughout all the exercises, because while we're doing the inhale and the exhale and doing the exercises, some of the exercises actually can be way more impactful. And it's also sometimes easier to practice. So tip for today, <laughs> challenge for today, working on that breath. Amazing, shake it out. Okay, we're going to the right side. Really stretch out those hips. You can grab your knee and push it a little out. Really feel this deep stretch in that hamstring. Coming into Spider-Man. And reach the right arm to the sky and really feel your upper body rotate. Lengthen through the spine and stretch those shoulders, the hips, open them up. Great job. And come back down. And we're moving to the other side. Really lengthen through the leg here. You can open up your hips, give it a little extra push, maybe one or two inches. And coming into a Spider-Man position. You can leave your right leg uh, or knee on the ground or you can lift it up here, whatever feels good for you. I want you to take a moment just for yourself here, something that feels good. Reach your left arm up to the sky, arm is lengthened. And look through the ceiling, feel the deep stretch. And come back here and we're going to the middle. Grab your elbows and swing from one side to the other side. Feet are pointed forward. Feel those hamstrings. Take a deep inhale through the nose. Exhale through the mouth. <sighs> Grab your legs and give yourself a little pull like you want to 
Tip your nose to the other side of the room. Really feel the hamstring stretch. We're going to need those today. Bend the knees and roll back up, bone by bone. And step up and shake it out. Okay, we're gonna start with a standing um, leg and butt series. Your feet are a little further than hip wide apart, shoulders are wide, arms come together. Come into a squat position and really feel, push through that heel, activate the glutes here and come back up and squeeze those glutes again. 10, nine, eight, inhale down, exhale up. Great job, you guys. Five more. Four, three, two, and one. And hold down here for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five. Push through that heel, through the glutes, squeeze that butt. Four, three, two, one. Reach the arms forward, open them up and close. Eyes are on the ground in front of you. And eight more. Eight, seven. Really squeeze those shoulders together up here. Like you wanna press those shoulder blades together. Pull the abdominals in, keep yourself balanced. There we go, four more. Almost there. Three, two, and one. Hold. 10 little circles with the arms forward. Come on. <laughs> I know, we're feeling the glutes. We're feeling it burn. Almost there. Five, four, three, two, one. And rotate back. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And come back down and squeeze it out. <sighs> Give yourself a little stretch here. Well, the glutes are activated. <laughs> and on the other side, great job. Okay, I'm going to stand on the side. Feet are hip wide apart. Come in a small seated position, arms are down. Put your weight on your right leg and really push through the heel. Pull the abdominals in and shoulders are wide. Inhale, exhale. We're going to extend the arms and the legs backwards in a 45 degree angle. Tap in, out, and in. Great job, eight more. Seven, really feel that extension, push to the heel. Six, five, four, Focus on the breath here. Three, two, and one. Hold out. Place your hands behind your neck. Open up the chest. Shoulders are low. Try to relax them here. Inhale, exhale. We're lower back down. Come back up. Chest lifts here for 10. Nine, feel that burn in the glute. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one, arms backwards, palms face up to the sky. We're holding here for 10, nine, eight. You're done after this one. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Come back up, shake it out. Feeling that deep burn, We're working legs here without any equipment can be so intense. We're going to the other side. Again, feet are hip wide apart. Slight bent in the knee. 
shoulders are relaxed. Pull the abdominals in. Inhale, exhale, reach the arms and legs and extend through the spine. Pull the abdominals in. Your arms are to the ground in front of you. Really push through that left glute. Tap, legs and arms in and extend. Feel the long, long extension for 10, 9, 8, engage the core, we're working full body, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1, hold out, bring your arms behind your neck, relax the shoulders, really squeeze those glutes, pull the abs in, and we're lowering the chest and coming back up for 10, 9, focus on the breath, keep breathing, and really have your own pace here, if you want to go a little slower, that's totally fine, don't go faster, we want to keep this motion very controlled, really squeeze those glutes, the left side, press through the heel, great job, four more, almost there, and then we're almost going to the ground, <laughs> two, all our favorites, and one, hold here, bring the shoulders back, palms facing up to the sky, shoulders are wide, really take away those shoulders from the ears, look forward and hold here for six, five, four, three, two and one, bring everything in and shake it out, shake everything, bring the legs wide, reach forward, Grab with your left arm, your right leg, and reach your right hand to the sky. Feel the hamstring. And walk over to the other side. Stretch on the left. Left arm reaches onto the sky. Bend the knees and roll back up. Vertebra by vertebra. Great job. We got the hard part done, standing series. We are going to the back of the mat. I always need to get over that first. Okay, hip, uh, feet are hip wide apart. Slight bend into the knees, pull the abdominal in. Shoulders are wide. Reach the arms to the sky and roll bone by bone over an imaginary ball and walk your hands out into a plank position, pull the abs in, shoulders wide, engage the glutes and hold and bring the hips up and slowly walk back, bend the knees and roll vertebra by vertebra up, head, neck and shoulders come last, roll the shoulders, bring the arms up, reach to the sky, inhale, Exhale, roll over this imaginary ball. Hands come to the ground. Walk them out step by step into a plank position. Shoulders are wide. Engage the core. Pull those abs together. Inhale, exhale, bring the hips back up. Walk hands to your feet. Bend the knees and roll back up. Bone by bone, head, neck and shoulders come last. Reach the arms into the sky, shoulders are down, core is in. Roll down, last time. Bring the hands to the ground. Come into a plank position and hold. Shoulders are wide, abs are in, glutes are fired up, squeeze all the muscles and hold for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. 
bring the right knee into the chest and extend them out for a deep stretch. When you come back in, reach the right knee to your left elbow and rotate there. And come back up in a deep stretch. Five more. Five. Four. Working the abs, working full body here. Shoulders are wide. Three. Two. Oh, my poor plant today. My legs are too long. <laughs> Hope you have space at home here. Two. And one. Knee comes across. Bring the knee to your right side. Left side. Right side. And left side. Bring it back into a plank position. Come to the, your knees and give your body a deep stretch here. And you feel the shoulders. Inhale through the nose, exhale through the mouth. Let everything go. Move your arms to the right side, really extend. And bring the arms to the left side. Great job. Coming back to our all fours. Extend the right leg, extend the left leg. Pull the abdominals in, shoulders wide. Bring the left knee towards your chest and extend them far up for a deep, long stretch. Really extend that rack, reach to the sky. Bring the knee in to your watch your chest, to your right elbow. Really feel that extension and reach back up. In and up. Make sure to cross the knee here, working the abs. And three more. Feel the deep stretch, maybe one inch further. <laughs> Push yourself a little here. Three. Two and one, hold here. Bring the knee to the left elbow, to the right elbow. Left elbow, right elbow. Two more, one and two. Bring the leg into plank position, hold here and come back to your hands and knees. Take a deep inhale, exhale out. And we're rolling back to hands and knees. And we're coming into a cat cow position. Really stretch it out. And really press those shoulders wide. Far up, relax the head. And come into a cow position. Reach your nose towards the sky. Do this a couple times. Take your own pace here, whatever feels good. And you just let everything go of the energy of today. Maybe you want to take some really big circles with your upper body. <sighs> Maybe to the other side. Maybe you want to move a little more. Do whatever feels good for you. Be kind to your body. And then to knees. <sighs> Coming to the back. Sit down on your butt and lay down. Feet are hip wide apart, heels pressing to the ground. Shoulders are relaxed and wide. Make sure they're not up here. Really elongate your neck and relax. Reach your arms to the sky. Inhale to prepare. Exhale, bring your head, neck and shoulders up and really engage that core here. We're reaching the arms up and down, up and down, up and down. Really feel the strength through the arms. Four more, four, three, two, and one. Come back to a hover and roll head, neck and shoulders down to the mat. Bring the hands behind your neck, inhale, 
exhale, head, neck and shoulders come up, coming to a little sit up, hands to the knee, hands back to your shoulders and roll back down. 10 little sit ups like this. Up, reach the arms to the knees, come back to the neck and roll back down. Head, neck and shoulders less. Inhale to prepare, exhale, come back up and hold, reach, Come back to your head and roll back down. Great job. Five more. Pull those abdominals in. Use your core. Extend. Come back and down. Extend. Keep breathing. Inhale to prepare. Exhale, move your head, neck and shoulders up. Use your core and bring the arms down. And two more. Last one. Come back up, extend the arms. Come back, head, neck, shoulders down and roll back down. Inhale, come to sit up. Arms are extended. Reach your left arm to your left heel and come to the other side and really feel the side of your waist, side of your core working here. Go from one side to the other side. I know, feeling the burn. <laughs> okay, five more. Four, three, two, and one. Come back to the middle and roll back down. Really elongate those arms and legs. Bring your arms into a cactus position, 90 degree angle. Bring the legs in. Stretch them to the right side. Take a deep inhale through the nose. Exhale through the mouth. Come back to the middle and to the other sides, to the left. Your head moves to the right side. Take a deep inhale through the nose. Exhale through the mouth, let everything go. The tension in your neck, your shoulders, your upper body, your back. And come back to the middle. Hands come into the sky. Bring your right leg into tabletop, your left leg into tabletop. Inhale, exhale, reach the right leg in a 45 degree angle. And really lengthen through the leg. Pull the abdominals in, use your core, and come back in. Other side, left. 10, nine, eight. Really keep this motion slow and controlled. Seven, your head is on the ground. Give your shoulders a little rest. Six, five. Four, three, two, one. Leg is out, lower down and up for 10, nine. We're gonna use those lower abdominals here. Shoulders are relaxed and wide. Pull the abdominals in. Six, five, four, three, keep breathing, two, and one. Leg is up, bring back into a tabletop, take a deep inhale through the nose, exhale, reach the right leg out, and lift down and up for 10, nine, pull those abs together, shoulders are wide, seven, Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Bring the knee back in and give yourself a nice hug and roll a bit back and forward. Be nice to your spine. <sighs> Lengthen the legs out, in, take a deep inhale. Exhale through the mouth. Bring the legs back, feet on the ground, 
arms are behind the neck, legs come into a tabletop. Inhale to prepare, exhale, head, neck and shoulders come up. We're going to reach again, but this time your head, neck and shoulders are actually off the ground, so it's a little more challenging for 10 and switch here. Nine, eight, keep breathing. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. And lower the head, neck and shoulders down. Black, come down. Okay, black come back into a tabletop, head, neck and shoulders come up. Reach the right leg out and rotate your upper body. Reach your right armpit to your left knee. Hold here for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5. Your right leg is a little hover above the ground. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And switch. Rotate your right your left armpit to your right knee and hold for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and switch on pace. 10, nine, bicycles, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Come back to the middle, lower the head, neck, and shoulder. Bring your leg to the ground. Great job. We're going to do some preparation for some extra butt work. Put your hands on your hip bones. Inhale, exhale, tilt the pelvis round. Really press that back into the ground and come back to a neutral. You can put your hands on top here to feel the motion, how your pelvis is like tilting under. Do this a couple times, just to prepare. And really feel that scoop here. There we go, one more. And place your arms beside you on the mat. Your shoulders are wide, neck is relaxed. Your feet are hip wide apart. Inhale, squeeze those glutes, tilt the pelvis and bone by bone, Reaching up, we're coming into a glute bridge. Relax the shoulders again, and we're holding here. And we're rolling bone by bone, back down into a neutral spine. Tilt the pelvis, and roll bone by bone, back up. Warming up the spine, warming up those glutes. Inhale to prepare, exhale, roll back up. Give it a nice squeeze and roll back down. One more time, tilt the pelvis, roll back up and hold here for 10, nine, eight. You really wanna push those hips onto the sky. Five, four, three, two, one. Hip dips for 10, nine, Eight, really squeeze those glutes when you're up there. Really squeeze and lower down. Squeeze, lower down. Keep breathing. Inhale through the nose. Exhale through the mouth. Shoulders are relaxed. Your upper body is getting a little rest here right now. Great right job. Two more. And hold up here. Hold for 10, nine, Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Arms can reach towards the sky and lower down for 10, nine, eight, keep squeezing, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Arms are up, 
and roll back down. Bring your right leg on top of your left and just stretch those glutes here. Bring your, pull your left knee towards your chest. Feel the stretch. You guys are doing amazing. Deep inhale through the nose, exhale through the mouth. Switch, the left leg comes on top of the right leg. Grab underneath your knee and pull towards your chest and feel that hamstring stretch here. Shoulders are relaxed and let everything go. I'm still for, sore from our last leg and butt workout, so this is going to. <laughs> help a lot. It's one of my favorite and most effective stretches. There we go. Okay, bring the heels back to the ground. Heels together, toes apart in a Pilates feet. The arms are in, next to your side. Press them into the ground. Shoulders are wide. Inhale to prepare. Exhale. Roll your hips up and really squeeze those glutes. Going into 10 hip tips again. For 10, 9, 8, 7, working the inner thighs here, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Hold up here for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, Five, four, three, two, one. Mini pulses. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five. We're feeling that burn. Three, two, and one. Hold up here. Close those knees together. Open them up. Squeeze together. Open them up. For eight, seven, six. Imagine you have a ball in between your knees and you're pressing them in and out. Four, three, two, and one. And roll back down. Shake out your legs. Great job. Bring the knees in. Feet are normal, normal side. Inhale to prepare, exhale, we're rolling back up. Put your weight in your left glute, in your left heel, and reach the right leg up to the sky. Hold here for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Lower the leg down a 45 degree angle and up. 10, 9, Eight, seven, six, keep the hips up. Five, four, three, two, and one. Lower the leg down. Get yourself centered back. Your weight into the right heel, your right hip. Your left leg extends up into the sky. Keep both hips up to align. Shoulders are wide, abs are in. And really extend through that leg. Five, four, three, two, one. Lower the leg in a 45 degree angle. Keep the hips straight and up. Reach back to the ceiling. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, Four, three, two, and one. Bend the knee, hold in the middle, and roll back down for the goodbye And really loosen up those, loosen up those legs. Bring your right knee towards your chest. Really pull. Maybe you want to put it to the outside to really open up those hips. 
know we had a really good glute series here. <laughs> and extend back. Bring, bend your left knee and bring your knee towards your chest. Great job. We're going to roll to the left side of our body. Come to the back of the mat. Bring your left elbow underneath your head. Your legs extend in front of you. Pull the abdominals in. Your right arm comes in front of you to give you some more stabilization. Bring the legs forward so they're reaching to a diagonal onto the mat. It's very important throughout these exercises to engage the abs and keep the shoulders open so we're working not only our glutes and outer thighs, but also our abdominals. So, placing the arms in front of us, really lengthen through the feet, and we're going to lift the right leg a little bit further than hip width apart, flex the foot and lower down. So lengthen up, flex, come down. For 10, nine, pull the abdominals in, Really engage your core. Make this a nice flowy movement, working those outer thighs here. Great job. Keep smiling. <laughs> Shoulders are relaxed. And four more. Three, two, and one. Hip comes up, heels flex, ten little pulses up. Ten, nine, eight. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Heels together, toes apart, Pilates feet. Going to lift right leg up, external rotated, and then tap the toes together, rotate back, tap the heels together. Pull the abdominals in, tap the toe, heel to heel. For eight, Seven, keep the chest open. Six, I know we're feeling the burn. <laughs> Me too, I'm shaking. Four, three, two, and one. And lower down, give yourself a little rest here. And we're bringing the knees back into a 90 degree angle. We're going to open up the right leg and lower down into a clamp for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. 10 little circles forward. 10, 9, Pull the abdominals in, shoulders are wide. Really working that outer glute here. Great job, you guys. Five, four, three, two, one. Your favorite word in Pilates, reverse, almost there. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. And lower down, give your hip a little rest here. Take a deep inhale. Great job. Okay. We're going to extend the legs. Bring the right leg in front of you. The left leg. Squeeze the inner thigh and lift it up one inch off the ground. And come back down. For 10, 9, 8, 7, Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Hold here for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Little circles forward. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Reverse back. 10, nine, eight, Seven, Let's keep the shoulders wide, pull the abdominals in. Five, four, three, two, 
two and one. Reach the legs together. Push yourself up. We're coming to the other side. Lay on the back of your mat. Your right arm comes underneath your head. The left arm comes in front of you for, before your chest. Pull the abdominals in. Reach your legs to a diagonal on the other side of the room. Extend through the leg. We're going into a lift and down. Flex the heel for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6. Really push through that heel. 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Now we're going to do the same motion, but this time we're extending through the leg and through that feet. Flex the foot and come down. Up, flex down. Stretch up, flex down. And do this for eight more times. Eight, seven, pull the abdominals in, keep the chest open. Make this a nice fluid motion. Four, three, two, and one. Now, when to press your heels together, toes apart into a Pilates V. You're going to lift the left leg up, external rotate, tap the toes together, make this rotation back and heels together. Tap the toes, heel to heel, toe to toe, Heel to heel. Pull the abdominals in. Use your core for stabilization. Great job. And four, three, two, and one. And lower it down. Give your hip a little press here. <laughs> Bend the knees. Come back in. Okay, we're going to Lift the leg up into a clam and lower down. This is a nice 90 degree angle up and down. Pull the abdominals in. Seven more. Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Low, have it here in a little hover. 10 little circles forward. 10, nine, Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. And back for ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. And come back down. Extend both legs. Bring your left leg in on top of the right. And your knee is on, on your hip height. Extend through the right leg and squeeze them one inch off the ground into a hover. And lower down for 10, nine, eight, working that inner thigh, pull the abdominals in. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Hold up here for 10. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Ten little circles forward. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Ten circles back. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Two and one. Give it one more squeeze, really lengthen through it. Last push, five, four, three, two, one, and lower down. Bring your hips back, the little song. Amazing, you guys are done. Push yourself up here. We're going to stretch it out. I'm doing all fours. Bring your right knee in front of you into your pigeon stretch. Shoulders are open and wide. Take a deep inhale through the nose. And on the exhale, let yourself fall forward. You can rest your head on top of your hands. 
Really feel the deep stretch here. Try to let everything go. Start with your toes, your legs, your hips, upper body, arms, fingertips. Let yourself rest here. Feel the stretch. Take a deep inhale through the nose. Exhale through the mouth. One more time. Inhale through the nose. Exhale through the mouth. And press yourself up. Grab your right leg backwards and pull it towards you. I haven't done this either in a long time. I feel this deep stretch in my quads. Keep the chest open. Feel the stretch. If you find this uncomfortable or this is um, too advanced, you can still stay in the pigeon stretch and give yourself a little longer time. And come back. I'm going to the left leg, forward into the pigeon stretch. Really start setting up straight, shoulders wide. Inhale through the nose. Exhale, fall forward into a deep pigeon stretch here. And again, let everything go. Your shoulders, your neck, you guys did amazing today. Worked all those glutes. And abs. Take a deep inhale through the nose. Exhale through the mouth. And go back up. Bend the right knee. Grab it with your right arm and open up the chest. Look backwards. You feel the stretch here. Take a deep inhale. And exhale through the mouth. And let it go. Bring yourself into a downward facing dog. Walk out those feet. Stretch the hamstrings. Take your own pace here. Bring the heels up and press them into the crown. And up, press them into the ground. Walk your hands towards your feet, bend the knees and roll back up further, baby, further. I want you to stand in the middle. Close your eyes and really try to relax your full body. Take a deep inhale through the nose. Exhale through the mouth. Shake it out. You guys are done for today. I hope you guys enjoyed um, today's full body or mostly glutes and leg and ab workout. And I will see you guys in our next video.